when we think about structural changes, we're starting to think now about the connections between different nerve cells in the brain. So each nerve cell has an ending at parts of it that we call synapses when they connect with another nerve cell. And in the past, we usually didn't talk about synapses as structural or structural changes, but we do think synapses are very fluid in their changes, and we are now starting to speak about them as structural changes. So one way to think about visual snow syndrome is that it may be a structural change at the synaptic level. So not that you will lose parts of the brain or part of the brain will degenerate, or there will be a space or extra growth. We don't have any evidence of major structural changes like that, but there may be minute and really um, areas of change that are very small, not able to be seen on an MRI, for instance, but probably occur at the synaptic level.